Hello, welcome to Daily Bible Study. Today we're going to look at Ephesians 2 8. For by grace you have been saved through faith, and that not of yourselves, it is the gift of God. What a powerful verse it is. Let's look at the word grace. Grace in Greek is charis. It means preeminently used of the Lord's favor freely extended to give himself away to people. So grace, God's grace is free and he is giving himself to us. So to him it is not free because he is giving himself, he is sacrificing himself, but to us it's free because we didn't do anything to earn this. God just gave it to us. Let's go back to this verse again. For by grace you have been saved through faith. So you see that grace comes first by God's grace through faith. So God uses our faith, but ultimately and that not of yourselves. It is the gift of God. So ultimately the salvation is the gift. Yes, there is faith involved there, but ultimately it is the gift of God. Now, what is that gift? Himself. God gave Himself to us. Now, let's compare with other religions. Other religions is human effort to reach to God, but our God is the God of grace. He reaches down to us. This is what grace is. And this is the truth. Main idea is salvation is gift of God. God saves people by His grace. Man cannot save himself. Church is saved by God's grace through faith in Him. So the application is we always need to remember God's amazing grace that saved us from eternal sin and death. It is very easy to forget about this and we can still try to earn God's grace. No, we cannot do that. We always need to preach the gospel to ourselves and we need to stop all human efforts to earn salvation and we need to surrender, fully surrender to God's sovereign grace. And let's meditate on this and let's pray continually. Praise God for giving Himself as the gift for us. Repent sense of all your efforts to earn God's favor. Ask God's grace to fill your hearts. to meet someone to share God's grace. In Jesus' name we prayed. Amen.